Good morning. Just putting my shoes on. I feel like Mr. Rogers. <laughs> putting my shoes on. Getting ready for the beautiful day. Is it a beautiful day in your neighborhood? <laughs> okay. Let's see if anybody's going to hop on live. Give it another few seconds. <clears throat> do do do. Well, maybe I'll just start talking about um, something that I was thinking about when I woke up this morning. There's um, there's a real potency in acknowledging what it is that you have come here to be. And so I was, I was like pulling strings of the different things in my life that I have come here to be. And I wonder if you can just look throughout your whole life here and and start to wonder, like, what, what have I come here for? What am I being that's different than anybody else? And it's not even something that you can necessarily feel or perceive because you are it, you be it. You don't actually feel it. It feels like air. It's just who you are. But if you start to look at what is it that you've come here to be? What is what what energy are you that's completely different than anybody else? And so I was pondering this this morning and looking at all the different ways that I've just had this thing ever since I was a little kid of desiring to, oh my God, it's gonna make me cry. <laughs> to inspire the world. And when I was a little kid, I um, had this dream of putting out these inspirational things on everything, on um, pillows and mugs and sheets and like mirrors, everything so that people would choose something different so that they would choose the peace and the joy that I know is possible. Oh goodness. And um, after I graduated college, I created this business of actually um, putting these images and words on little stones called magic stones. And it was amazing. Um, they're very inspirational and I didn't know what I was doing creating a business, but it, it spread all over the world. Spreading peace and joy, inspiration, magic, possibility into the hands of anybody who was willing to have it. And after like 10 or 20 years of creating that business, um, I wanted to do something different. And, um, and actually increase the inspiration and, and the magic even larger than what that created. And that's what I desire to do with sharing these tools of access consciousness. So regardless of what it looks like, or regardless of, you know, what, what you would like to see in the world and what choices you'd like to make to bring that into a reality, like just, just go for it, choose it. 
if it's light, that's right and true for you. So just choose it. Wow. <laughs> that was interesting. I'm going to just grab a Kleenex because my nose is running. Um, so let's, let's see if you can just tap into that energy of who, who you be and what it is that you bring to the world that's different, even if you don't have words for it, even if you have no clue what I'm talking about, just be with it for a moment and ask yourself the question, even if it doesn't make any sense. I have no idea why I wanted to see peace and love and joy in the world. I do. And you think, oh, who am I to create that? But you are an infinite being. And as we do this expand exercise, you can start to perceive the infiniteness of the being that you are. So start to perceive the energy of you and the energy that you be around your body and start to expand that to fill the room that you're in. You, the being, are much larger than your body and you can expand out as great as you would like to, infinitely. So filling the room that you're in and notice how your body relaxes as you begin to expand your awareness, expand the being that you are. And now expand beyond the walls, the ceiling and the floor, expanding in a big bubble circle around your body at least 10 miles in all directions. And no matter where you are, if you're up many stories in a building or if you're on a ground level, expand into the earth. Feel the connection that you can have with the earth. and continue, continue expanding 100 miles in all directions, 1,000 miles in all directions, 10,000 miles in all directions, 100,000 miles, Perceive the joy <laughs> that is possible in expanding your being and the energy that that creates in your body. What would it be like if you put your energy into this world? Would it change the world? And what if we didn't hold it back and reserve it or hide it? Let's infuse our energy into this reality so that this reality changes. Sorry, sniffle. <laughs> I 
and let's pull massive amounts of energy from the earth through the space of us, through our bodies. Creating the connection with this planet, with each other. And what can we create in the world when we are being this being that each one of us is? Happy Monday, everybody. And um, um, take this energy and infuse it throughout your whole week. Infuse it throughout your entire future. And be you. All right. Have an awesome, awesome week, and I will see you next week. Oops, my computer is not ending.